Hello guys, welcome back. I'm really sorry for such a late uploading. It was a big gap between videos, but today we have just tremendously terrible topic. Crisis on Dr. Martens. Gosh, this happens every time. I don't know. It depends on the weather and you can see the crisis here. Just trust me, we will get rid of them. Absolutely. We will do some magic and uh, I hope you enjoy the video. If you enjoy the, vi the video, please click that li like button and subscribe to my channel. I really need you guys. So this area here is very, very uh, bad. It's almost every time I clean it, it's just, gosh, it's so messy, guys. Oh, I got it too serious here, okay? Okay, um, yeah, so I cleaned this up. Everything should be ready for our um, next step. And what is our next step? It's cleaning. Uh, I use acetone to clean all the old polishes, all the old stuff the owner could apply. Yeah, so to get a really good view. What is it? What is it, guys? It's a hole there. Of course, it's not a hole like that gets just through the whole shoe no it's uh, so when we talk about shoe we have the top layer and the bottom layer uh, t and uh, they are uh, got they got together and uh, <clears throat> yeah what happened uh, with this pair only the top layer of leather was so damaged yeah so it really easily fixed uh, what I use here is uh, rubbing paper rubber paper sorry and yeah you see what I do I just added glue. I, um, I I laid all the top layer of leather that was really bad with the rubber uh, paper, and I just glued the top and bottom layer. And I will apply, or sorry, I will uh, delete some more of uh, leather that is there with the rubber paper. As you can see, I do it now. So basically. I just removed the just very very bad hole that was now uh, some conditioning conditioning is very important and conditioning most of the time people say that the conditioning is the problem that uh, causes this those creases yeah and uh, I agree with them that's true but sometimes at the same time people say that they uh, condition their skin I mean uh, the shoes their shoe skin but that oh I'm playing piano here but it doesn't work yeah so come on I'm just like a penis very good job like I do this very good now uh, as you can see the color is not really good so I apply just black cream uh, it's Saphir cream it's uh, very very good I r strongly recommend you to, to use Saphir goods because they're just amazing but if you, you you can use any you want yeah so that you could color uh, the leather that we just opened opened up we will close it with the cream and it will look like a new shoe basically you can see that now it looks much much more better like it looks just amazing now of course it's not the finish for me I will I will try to um, oh, what do do? okay clever boy uses more and more uh, polish okay I want to um, make some glossage here for this pair Ooh, I got too serious okay <laughs> to make some glossage for this pair and um, I hope it will be really good. I hope you will enjoy it. I think it's a good, yeah, I really know the result, so I think it's good. I hope you will enjoy it. You will enjoy it, sorry. Yeah, um, here, uh, the method is really easy. You apply uh, some of the polish, yeah, and uh, you use water, applying water, a little bit of polish, and that's all. Yeah, you just rub it, rub, 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 rub and at the end, um, it will look just perfectly shiny just take a look just take a look what this guy is doing yeah so basically like this you can see the room inside <laughs> I of your shoe just amazing 
yeah so here is uh, the second the second shoe I do the same all the same stuff I did with the first one and of course there wasn't a hole as it was with the first one uh, but you know it takes time uh, be patient that the only advice I could give you when you do some work like this because um, if you're not patient you can just damage shoe and it won't be really good you won't save your shoe will just throw it away because it won't be able to um, restore it yeah so yeah quickly really <laughs> very quickly it looks so fast here yeah so here it is I think it's just amazing I hope uh, I hope guys uh, you agree with me that this restoration is absolutely crazy and uh, you know a lot of guys think that just it's impossible to restore Martins with these uh, with those creases yeah but you see it's possible and it's very very easy so yeah I just lace them up now you'll see how they look uh, will I show you how do you think will I show you guys I think I, I always do yeah so that's it yeah that's it oh god they look just perfect look at them look at them guys I, it, I, I deserve them I think I deserve it and your subscription La la la, just look at it, look at it. Yeah, here is how it came up, and this is before. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. One more time, please subscribe to this channel. Don't be lazy, because you know it's a lot of work, and I give you a lot of tips here. How should you do this? How to restore your shoes, even if you just we're going to throw them away thank you very much for watching see you next time next week bye